this is our house. George was in the house. This house is mine and no one else is coming in, George said. It's not your house, George, said Lindy. It belongs to everybody. No, it doesn't, said George. This house is all for me. Lindy and Marley went for a walk over to the swings. It's not George's house, is it? said Lindy. Of course it isn't, said Marley. Lindy and Marley looked through the window. It's not your house, George, and we're coming in. Oh no you're not, said George. This house isn't for girls. Freddy was walking past with his rabbity. I've come to put rabbity to bed, said Freddy. You can't, said George. This house isn't for small people like you. Freddy took rabbity for a ride in the car. Charlene and Marlene mended the front wheel. George won't let me and Rabbity in the house, said Freddy. Charlene and Marlene, Freddy and Rabbity headed straight for the house. Stop right there, said George. We're coming in to mend the fridge, said Charlene and Marlene. Oh no you're not, said George. This house isn't for twins. Luther's jumbo jet landed in the house. He went to fetch it. Where do you think you're going, said George. Flight 505 has crashed, said Luther. And I'm coming in for the rescue. Fire, fire, ee 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 You're not coming in here, said George. Luther radioed for help, calling Dr. Sophie, calling Dr. Sophie. Can I help you, said Sophie. We can't get at the plane, doctor, said Luther. Leave it to me, said Sophie. Sophie and Luther pushed past the crowds. Make way for the doctor, said Luther. We're coming in, said Sophie. Oh no you're not, said George. This house isn't for people with glasses. Rashida had a plan. I'm going to tunnel in. She poked her head under the house. Go away, said George. This is my house. Well, this is my tunnel, said Rashida. Well, tunnel somewhere else, said George. This house isn't for people who like tunnels. It was getting quite noisy around the house now. And hot and George wanted to go to the toilet. I'm going to leave my house now, said George, and no one can go in it when I'm gone. George went to the toilet. Lindy, Marley, Freddy, Rabbity, Marlene, Charlene, Luther, Sophie and Rashida went straight into the house. George came back. There was no room for George. This house isn't for people with red hair, said Charlene.
George began to shout. George began to cry. George began to stamp his feet and kick the wall. Then he stopped. He looked. This house is for people with red hair, said George. And for girls and small people, and twins and people who wear glasses, and like tunnels. Because, shouted Lindy, Marley, Freddy, Marlene, Charlene, Luther, Sophie and Rashida, this house is for everyone. 